So we've got two center fill boxes in the center of the planter. We can load two hybrids with this planter. And what we do is we coin these hybrids a defensive hybrid in one of the tanks and an offensive hybrid in the other tank. So right now we're limited to two hybrids, but it's a lot better than what we've got with just picking and choosing maybe one or two and planting them across the whole farm. One other way to think about it is, think if you've got two farms in your farming operation. You've got one farm over here, beautiful farm, yields really good, and you've got another farm 10 miles down the road that's not so good, tougher soils. Would you plant the same hybrid on both those farms? Probably not. So the same concept applies. We're going to take those same soil types, we're going to put them in one field. And so again, would you plant the same hybrid on all those soil types? I don't want to. I want to make sure that the hybrid is appropriate for every single management zone that we set up. So that's where we have to start with multi-hybrid corn planting. We've got to go into the field and create spatial management zones. We've got to find those soil types that don't yield as good. And then we've got to, we've got to find those soil types that generally are giving us the high, highest yield and we have to treat them differently within the field. And so what we start off with is just placing the right hybrid for every single acre. The important things we wanted to do in 14 was number one, single row multi-hybrid capability. The other thing we wanted to do was when we load a prescription into this, into this planter, we wanted to follow row by row population and hybrid transition. So most farmers are familiar with clutching activity. When you, when you do your end rows, you make that as applied pass. Then when you plant the long rows, you come across it and the planter will clutch on and off so it doesn't overplant. Same concept applies in the field while we're doing hybrid transitions. The, the, the planter is simply not all on or off. We go row by row transitions in the field.